this time I'm racing against the boat. Yeah, I saw it. Okay, so as soon as the head touches the gear, I will start running. Okay. Alright guys, good morning. Wet, wet Saturday morning. Yeah, supposed to come out early today to do my run while it was raining and yeah, things on and off, on and off. Still a little bit of drizzle. So, just run anywhere, anyhow. Let's go. something different I don't know whether it's free or you know just this hobby but at least you know we could still get out you know and uh, just yeah for your info um, the government actually uh, announced a safety measure all right I don't really want to call it a lockdown they don't really want to call it a lockdown all right so if you fact from Monday all the uh, shopping malls will be closed and uh, there's a curfew and everybody can only leave their home from 4 a.m to 9 p.m right unless necessary what else yeah you have to be home by 9 p.m and you can only leave after 4 a.m public transport as well so all the public transport like the bts right buses i'm not too sure about taxis 
you know, but as long as public transport, okay, they cease operation at 9 p.m. and only resume operation at 4 a.m. Okay, so this is the uh, safety measure um, that was announced by the government yesterday. So, wow, well, it's a partial lockdown, all right, uh, and there's some, you know, um, restriction going on, but the uh, malls are supposed to be closed, and uh, but um, supermarket, restaurants, you know, banks, essentials, yeah, are still allowed to open until I think about 8 p.m. All right, like stores like 7-Eleven convenience stores can only are only allowed to open until 8 p.m. and resume their operations at 3 a.m. or 4 a.m. I can't really remember, All right? But so there's a uh, yeah partial lockdown, not a complete lockdown, and uh, yep, yeah, can only leave home unless it's necessary. Even the government sectors are all you know working from home, right? Full force. And while well, numbers are getting up, um, not to show you know how things are going to be under control. But yeah, just wish everybody you know um, stay safe, and hopefully you know the country can get back to normal again and resume our daily life. Well, businesses have been affected, as you can see. You know, places like this behind me. Well, this is uh, Ashok. MRT and it was uh, behind me was the Terminal 21 and um, yep it's very very quiet and uh, just hope that you know, the economy starts to you know pick up you know businesses are closing out involving tourists and really hope you know we can have a you know good recovery and wow less so life can be affected right and hope everybody can stay safe and you know remain vigilant right so these are the um, this food are still selling very much okay life you know still very much um, goes on you know people still need to eat you know and still need to survive and still need to make some income so yeah so it's a global pandemic I hope it gets better let's keep running again Right, here we are, behind me is the MRT station. So the BTS and the MRT uh, operate third differently between, I think, maybe two different companies. So the BTS has a the rabbit card, but the MRT has a different store value card. So you can't actually mix them together, which is, I don't know, <laughs> quite interesting. All right, so there are different operators all together. So BTS uh, basically runs over you know they call it a sky train they used to call it a sky train because they are actually overhead outside and mrt actually have both okay mostly underground right but um to a certain areas they are also heading out you know um over the the bridges so this is uh, behind me Sukumvik station right it's blue color there's also a um, purple line that goes to nongtaburi where i used to you know work and stay there before yeah so here it is, it's just beside Ashok and this is actually an interchange with Ashok uh, BTS station. Right, we are at this uh, Param Kao MRT station, Rama 9, all right, Param 9 MRT station. So behind me is actually Fortune Tower, right, it's just like our Simlim Tower or Simlim Square. Okay, so you have all the IT staff, all the electronic staff over here, and uh, my project staff, right, I'm in the AV industry, audio visual, so my project staff, I also purchase it, all right, behind here. 
Okay, so this is uh, Ramanai station. So because we are along Ramanai Road, and uh, on my right side, all right, you see over here is the uh, Central Plaza, Ramanai. Okay, so yeah, sorry, it's called Fortune Town, not Fortune Tower. It's Fortune Town. Okay, so if you want to come here, there's this mall. Okay, at Central Plaza, really huge. At this station. Okay, here we are at this uh, train market. I'm not too sure if they are still open, but anyway, they only open at 5 uh, to 1 a.m. So I still see these shops around, so I guess, yep, they'll still be open. Maybe I can drop by again. Yeah. Yeah, the stores are still around so I guess they are pretty much open it's just that it seems like there are actually lesser stores right now so probably I can have a separate video to check out this train market
Okay, behind me is actually the uh, Hui Huang Market, Night Market. Alright, it's called Talat Hui Huang. So it's actually beside Hui Huang uh, MRT station. Okay, so if you drop by and then you can come over here. So uh, it's very much a local market. I like to come here because of the uh, nice food. So, yeah, behind me is the uh, popular Ganesha shrine. Okay, a lot of people come here and actually pray to this temple over here. one of the areas that I used to came here before but don't really have much knowledge of what the temple is all about but the night market has really nice Thai food very local Thai food and the uh, price is it's actually not that expensive it's really cheap okay so if you have a chance just come over here at this uh, Hui Huang night market okay I'm pretty much at this um, street actually it's a long Bachada State Road So along the uh, blue MRT line This is uh, the first time that I'm running in this area Okay, a pretty quiet place with not much things Except some buildings, offices Otherwise, yeah, it's a very very long street And uh, just gonna keep running and then see how long my GoPro can last me. The battery is getting flat. Okay, I'm at uh, the next station. Okay, BL17. BL, I think it's blue line, right? So, this on station. Okay, not too sure what is around here. Apparently, I think there are some markets around, but they're all closed. It's a hot pot. Okay, I miss Mala Ho Kuo. Okay, Lao San Tong. Okay, actually, I like the uh, Mala Xiang Kuo, but I cannot find any here. I heard there are some, but never really go and explore and find them. So, if I happen to see them, yep, I'll let you know. So, just keep running until my GoPro battery finish. really and like a open space so night bazaar does that mean that the only opens at night I don't know Earlier on, I was saying that uh, the night bazaar, the building is actually called the bazaar. Right? What be said. So this is the building. Really huge. But apparently, I think it's empty. Nothing is open. Four hours in the market. I'm not sure if they're open. Yeah. No dinosaur. <sighs> if 
quite interesting. Hey, out of nowhere, along the street, there's a workout corner over here. It's pretty random. Oh, actually, there are quite a few of them. I didn't really realize. If you look at it, it's pretty nice, actually. Yeah. So in front, there's another one. It's actually a hotel just behind me, the Bazaar Hotel. And this is another workout. Sunlom Night Bazaar. Machala Pise. Carousel. The kids will love this. It's actually quite nice. So I just turn around and you can have a look. Okay. It's just beside the uh, Buddha. Right, the dinosaur over there. Okay, so it's a bizarre hotel, Bangkok. It says here. I guess it's uh, pretty much closed. I see it. I saw it. I saw it. Okay, it's right in front of me. And wonder what station is this? <coughs> okay, station BL Blue Line 1515. Okay, the station name is not now. Yeah. Okay. There's one more station. We'll be meeting the BTS. Okay. Familiar. We are actually near the Tatu Chak Weekend Market. I remember this 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 area. I mean, as in like this the name of this area. I haven't been in this area, but yeah, the name is familiar. This stretch of the road is very long. Never ending from La Prao to the next station. Oh, I don't know where is it. One moment rain, one moment sun. Oh. Yeah, finally, I can see some shops. All around and yeah, very nice. Much more. That's in front of me. Yeah, this. You just shopping. I don't know what. Yeah. Usually in such a mall, they are quite close to the station. That means I'm really near to the station, really. Union Mall, yeah, this is actually Union Mall, the name of this mall. So the malls are usually built quite near to the station. That means I should be quite near. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I already saw the station just opposite me. Oh, I don't know what station, is there an entrance here? Yeah. There's one in front of me. Ah, the entrance. <laughs> okay, this BL14, Pahon Yotin. If I pronounce it correctly, how do you Okay. So usually around the MRT station or the BTS station, you can see malls like this, or at least something that is happening, right? So this is Union Mall. Okay. Apparently, there's a lot of malls over here. But again, sadly, yeah, malls are ordered to close due to the COVID numbers. They're going up. Okay, but by the time I think you see this video, we are actually in the uh, so-called uh, partial lockdown already. Okay, so it actually starts on Monday, the uh, 12th of July, and actually today is the 10th of July. Yeah, my dad's birthday. Happy birthday, dad. <laughs> okay, but then, by the time you see this video, uh, it's already really over already. Okay, so this is Tong Yotin. But I, I'm not wrong. 
this station is just beside the BTS. Am I right? Or am I wrong? pedestrian crossing over here so I have to actually run and cross this complicated road and watch out for cars that are coming from the lower direction okay, go 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 oh, I have to watch out to my back to my left okay, there's no car okay, this is the place that I was running I was facing the BTS station towards the north line. Yeah, you can look behind. Those overhead flyover, there's no way that they can actually build. I don't know whether they can build or cannot build, but there's no pedestrian, proper pedestrian crossing. So, huh. I remember this place as a, actually a tunnel It's not really a tunnel but more of a cover walkway from the BTS station and uh, now I'm actually heading towards the Chakuchak uh, MRT station which is beside Mochi Cover walkway. Alright, these are the cover walkway that goes all the way to the BTS station. There. That's the BTS station. Okay, this is the walkway. Nice. Oh, there's somebody here. Maybe. Uh -huh. Okay, the last time when I was. Uh, Chasing the station was on the other direction. Look! Wow! More cheap. Okay, yeah, correct. So, just beside me is actually the uh, Sapucha Park. Haven't been there before. There's still a lot more to explore. For now, hey, <coughs> nice. The sun is out, like I said earlier, and then it's drizzle, sun, but wet, dry, hot, cold, and also hungry. <sighs> well, but that's how I spend my Saturday and weekends. Running around, exploring around, 